What's going on guys? Today we are at 5313 Sunny Slope Avenue here in Sherman Oaks, California. The house behind me has four bedrooms, three and a half bathrooms, and has 3,310 square feet of living space. It is currently on the market for $2,275,000. Let's go check it out. So this house is pretty unique from the other houses that we've been seeing on this channel so far. It is a single story modern farmhouse. And if you look at the exterior, it's definitely something different. You have that nice slant on the left side of the house. And then the center part of the house where the roof comes up a bit with the wooden exterior matching with the white and gray style as well here. Let's go inside. Before we enter inside, when you come up to the front door, you look up and you see this unique light fixture. It's a circle of light bulbs hanging by thick brown ropes from the ceiling, acting as your front porch light, definitely lighting up the whole front entrance. All right, we enter the house. First, follow me. We're gonna go to my left. And right behind me, first guest bathroom of the house. As soon as we walk in, See these motion sensor light bulbs? We have two of them up here. Nice half bath, but uh, let's go this way. Just follow me down this hall. We'll go there after we check out this room. I don't know if you guys got a sneak peek in there, but you're gonna love that room. First, let's go in here. First bedroom of the house. This is staged as an office right now, as it is the smallest bedroom here in the house. You see the nice wood table, and then two sides with windows, looking out onto the front yard. Beautiful little room, love the staging, recessed lighting, and then you also have a full bathroom right here. Follow me in here. Nice bathroom, full bath. You see the tub is in the shower, and the unique feature about this room is these black and white brick walls. And yeah, this is the full bath in this office. Now let's get out of here and show you that other room I was talking about. All right, come follow me in here. Check out this awesome theater room. You have the black leather couches all over with the LED lights that light up on the bottom and in the cup holders. I don't know about you, but uh, these are pretty comfy. I think I'm just gonna stay here all day. Checking out this side of the theater room. I love the staging in here. It's staged with some pretzels, kettle corn, bottle of wine, and two wine glasses. Then you have your projector on the wall, bordered by this black velvet material. Very nice. All right, now let's go check out the rest of the house. Turn the corner right here, going into the main part of the house. Look up to my left, see these nice cabinets windowed cabinets actually as you can see in there stayed with some nice black items such as a pineapple and a little bowl there as well some cool features now let's go right behind you check out the main dining room formal dining room right here Look up, you see this light fixture above with three circular lights, one smaller than the other. And I like these shelves that are just open, each with their own little light at the top too. So at night, this looks amazing, actually. And then behind me, the artwork we have, some elephants. Elephants, one of my favorite animals. Let me know what yours is. All right, let's move on. Before we go and check out the kitchen, I just want to mention that these are European oak wood floors that we see throughout the house. Also 10 foot ceilings with the recessed lighting. And then come follow me this way. In the kitchen we have the nice white quartz countertops, huge rectangular center island in the middle, state of the art appliances. You have the Bertazzoni oven, five burner stove, and then also this home is smart home ready with eight security cameras all over as well and a full alarm system too. Also in this kitchen you see the six light fixtures above the center island. They're hanging from a drop ceiling that looks like it's floating, not even detached to the ceiling. There's a really nice feature in the house. Very unique style about it. I love that part of the kitchen. I almost forgot to talk about the refrigerator because it's so well hidden right here actually through these nice steel handles, boom. Large fridge and freezer. 
It was perfectly hidden. I love the white color. Okay, now follow me into the formal living room. Definitely a lot of open space in this house, as you see from the open concept floor plan. They staged it with this nice area here as well, with a tall mirror and two little chairs. And then on this side, you have your little wine cellar, stocked with a bunch of bottles of wine. And as we keep walking along this way, lots of space here in the formal living room. And over here, normally where you would see a TV is actually a nice mirror as well with the light coming down. I really like that actually, makes it a little different. And then here are the pocket doors that lead you right out to the backyard, which we'll show you at the end actually, not after this part. And yeah, amazing living room, perfect for having a lot of friends and family over. It's so open, great entertainment space, indoor outdoor flow right there. And now we will show you the bedrooms. Although this isn't one of the biggest or luxurious mansions that we've featured on this channel, it's definitely one of the best for a small family in a nice neighborhood here in Sherman Oaks, just in the valley. But just follow me in this hallway, let's show you the rest. Right there's a nice coat hanger because this door is the garage. And then just outside the garage, it's a little washer and dryer hookup. Motion sensor lights actually, they just came on when we checked it out right now. And then as I said, your coat hanger, walk right in, put your coats down and then walk down your hallway. Turn into here, here's the first bedroom. First bedroom here in the hallway, actually has a nice walk-in closet. Now there's no bathroom in here, but it's definitely one of the most cozy bedrooms of the house right outside of the garage. You walk right in, come into your bedroom, and boom, you're home. Now follow me into this bathroom that's located just between these two bedrooms in the hallway. In here, you notice the 10 foot ceilings that we've seen throughout the house. And then right away, you see the dark sand colored walls with the nice patterns and unique textures that you have all around. That's very cool. You also have two sinks in here. One unique feature about these sinks I like is the gold handle with the black swerve of the faucet right there. All right, now let's go back into the hallway, check out the other bedroom on the other side of this bath. Similar bedroom to the one on the other side of the bathroom. This one just doesn't have its own walk-in closet as the other one did. Has double doors leading to some nice space though. And then yeah, look how beautifully furnished this whole entire room is. Walk with me down this hallway. You can just see how nice this home would be for a small family. Very cozy, but very homey as well. Now here we are in the master bedroom. I love that the master bedroom has a slider leading right out to the pool. You can take a look behind me. Also have a walk-in closet right there. Follow me in this walk-in closet. Lots of space in here. I like that there's no island in the center. There's just lots of room for changing or doing whatever you have to do in your closet. Out of the closet, into the master bedroom. Now the walls in here are pretty unique actually as they were hand carved into this diagonal pattern on either end as well. Also the unique light fixtures with a little and a bigger bulb beside each other on each end of the bed. And then just follow me into the bathroom. Walking into the bathroom, we are greeted by the long white quartz countertop also, as you've seen throughout the house, but that the sinks are so far spread apart from each other, and there's all this space in between. And then you have the large windowed shower with your tub inside, actually, on the back right there. Take a look at that. Bathroom's amazing. You also have the toilet behind you in a little corner. You could close the door. Boom, just walk right through the slider from the master bedroom into the beautiful backyard. <laughs> You 
see out here, large grassy area, a lot of room to play. And also this backyard has the utmost privacy where these trees that are planted around the walls will grow so that your neighbors can't see in here. Beside me is the nice pool and spa with two beautiful flowing waterfalls. I love the staging out here as the wine bottle and glasses there, but also when I look in the pool, we have a little visitor right there. Look at that guy. Lizard right there with a crazy green and black pattern. Wow. He's just chilling, hanging out in the pool. Nice summer day. Who wouldn't want to be doing what he's doing? As we're walking along the backyard, I love the turf pattern with the concrete here at the patio area. And then you can see into the house right here with the pocket doors behind me. They open up all the way, creating that indoor-outdoor flow. All right, that was it for the outside backyard. And now I've just walked through the open pocket doors back into the living room here. And yeah, that was it. Thank you guys for watching till the end of the video. We just gave you a tour inside this beautiful home in Sherman Oaks, California. Listed for 2.2 million. If you guys like this video, please drop a like down below. We really appreciate that. If you wanna see more of these in the future, we are doing them every week and we'll continue on doing them as well. And we will see you on the next one.